morning everyone welcome to sst online classes for class 10 today we will continue our first chapter of civics power sharing in our previous video i explained that why the power sharing is desirable and why it is necessary for the overall development of a country with the example of sri lanka and belgium today i will tell you about the two main forms of power sharing that is horizontal power sharing and vertical power sharing first i will tell you about the horizontal power sharing horizontal power sharing means power sharing among different organs of the government there are three main organs of government that are legislature executive and judiciary the main function of legislature is to making a law and the main function of the judiciary is to implementation of laws that are making by the legislature now what is the function of judiciary the main function of judiciary is to protect the right of citizens so all these organs are at the same level but enjoy different responsibilities it is also known as check and balance system because they have power to check other organs and maintain the balance if something is going to be wrong now the second forms of power sharing is vertical power sharing vertical power sharing means power sharing among different level of government the main different level of government are the central government for the entire country the state government for a particular state and the other subordinate government as the name suggest they have their own level level means less to up the central government is the supreme or central power of a country that applied throughout the country it has the supreme power and the state government has lesser power than the central government and it is independent or it is free to take decision in a particular state but they have to take advice and they have to uh, inform central government about their policies and actions the third type of government is the subordinate government and also known as local government it is the smallest pillar of the government now in the level of government in the power sharing among different level of government there are the different levels means low to up and they have different power according to their level it means central government that is on the up level it has the most power and then the state level government that has lesser power and then the subordinate the least power i hope the main two forms of power sharing is clear for everyone thank you